The second day of vibrant Goa marked the inauguration of Goa Business School IT Summit. In the presence of Chief Minister Pramod Savant and Goa University Vice Chancellor Varun Sani. While addressing the gathering of 52 countries, Savant informed that the Goa startup policy will make Goa one of India's preferred startup destinations. The policy, he said, will give massive subsidies and incentives to aspiring startups, which includes one time grant of rupees 10 lakhs and special incentives for hiring Goan youth and encouraging innovation. Here's more. The check. The inaugural of Goa Business School IT Summit. Along with me, IT Minister Mrs. Jennifer Monserrat, the Chairman of GTA, Mr. Mangirish Salilkar, the Director of GYM, Professor Ajit Parodekar, the President of Vibrant Goa Foundation, Mr. Rajkumar Kamat, Dean of Goa Business School, Professor V.Y. Kamat, the Vice Chancellor of Goa University, the Professor Varun Sahani, the dignitaries in the audience. It is my pleasure to be here for this program, which is organized by Goa University in collaboration with Vibrant Goa. Very special expo as this an event that attracted the participants from over 52 countries besides the delegate, or delegate from all over the country. The response we have received for the IT stall as well as the session is very encouraging. In the indications of the immense scope that we have the information technology in Goa. It is a field where the lot of innovation possible. And the Goan students have a creative mind and capability coming up with a lot of innovative program. Our students have performed extremely well in Goa as well as the other state, as well as all over the world. We have seen the talent that our students possess in this sector. The program sponsored by the Department of Information Technology, the Government of Goa in association with Goa Technology Association and Atal Incubation Center with the objective of bringing together the partner institute from the India and abroad. The two-day joint meeting forging the new age collaboration in the field of IT. The focus is on innovation and use of cutting-edge technology to the wide range of applications areas ranging from the logistic, fintech, smart city, blue economy and manufacturing. The students should take the benefit of the session that is organized and understand the various opportunities that are available in the IT industry. It is a sector that will always continue to grow with the new technology and latest innovation coming up with the regular intervals. As I said in my speech yesterday, Goa's economic growth is driven by the strong performance of the industrial sectors such as tourism, IT and pharmaceuticals. The Goa, Goa IT policy focuses on infrastructure development physical incentives, governance and human resource development. It promised time-bound approval of the investment and incentives within a 90 days period and the aims to create 10,000 jobs to local. The Goa startup policy was launched to make Goa one of the most preferred startup destinations of India and make future in the 25 startup destination in, by, in Asia by 2025. The startup policy will give the massive subsidies and incentive to the startup, which includes the one-time grant of rupees 10 lakh and special incentives for hiring Goan youth and encouraging innovations. Our Minister for Information, Mrs. Jennifer Monserrat, is making all efforts to ensure that IT department is totally activated to see that our community get the benefits available. If on the 13th October there was a workshop to train the startups on how to pitch potential investor, today the Goa University has invited angel investor to give the select startup opportunity to present their ideas and pitching session. 
I want all of you to understand that you play a very important part in the development of our economy. With innovation, you can create new avenues for yourself and with a startup, you can contribute to the growth of our Govan economy. My best wishes are with all of you and my government will be there to support you wherever you should need our help. Once again, I compliment Goa University for organizing this two days program for the benefit of the student. Wishing you all the best for your future life. Once again, for the welcome for this summit and welcome for Vibrant Goa. Thank you, one and all.